Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is uh, Anything LLM, and I'm going to run it on Docker. Uh, let's take a look at the console. Let's assume that all of the Docker requirements are satisfied. Uh, Docker is installed, Yarn and Node, etc., is installed. <clears throat> and I go to history where you'll see all of my commands. And here it is. So I'm going to run it at 8999. And here goes nothing. All right. Well, that was easy. So now we're going to localhost 3001. localhost 3001, <clears throat> and it is all started. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. And this, there's no scroll, which really bugs me. Uh, I'm going to just scroll through and see if I can pull it this way. Uh, enter it manually. I don't enter Olama URL. Hmm. I guess I have to keep a llama running in another session, which that's uh, more than I know how to do. Let's see, Anthropic. OK, so if I put in my Anthropic key or my hugging face, Uh, all right, I'm, I'm going to go with whatever they, whatever these guys ship with. Mm, use with caution. All right, let's see what happens. Uh, just me for the time. No password. Run. Uh, all accessible. Yes, 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 yes. All right, I'm going to leave it all like that. Right. Skip survey. Test. OK. Uh, right. Mm, create an issue. And OK, issue. I thought create an instance. I was going to say that's pretty exciting. But that's not what it says. And let's go to the setup. Workspace, I don't need that. Chat settings, I'll leave that as it is. Agent configuration, uh, I go with a default. Hopefully, it's going to pick up whatever default it is. No, it doesn't look like it ships with its own. Agents will not work until a valid selection is made. But it doesn't ship with its own. Text generation. No. No, no, and no. OK, let's see if that works. Uh -huh. uh, so maybe I need to investigate how to. All right, let's just do a for giggles to see if Olama will give me. Uh, let's see, Olama. Okay, so Olama help. Maybe maybe Olama will kick out a URL for me. Let's see. Okay, so Olama. Serve. OK, so here it is. Uh, I've got an IP address. Let's see if that's enough to bind. And I'll keep it alive forever. Uh, base default, save Olama. I did enter a URL. So it didn't like my, it didn't like the URL that Olama kicked out. Oh, it's already being it's already being used. Huh. Already in use. That's weird. Cancel. 
Uh, okay, so that's not going to work, but let's see what can work, if anything. Uh, oh, yes, 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 yes. <clears throat> uh, I have the uh, anything LLM, so click, uh, right click on your beta. Okay, I don't want that, but how do I get the connection string? Let's ask. Okay, so here's, here's the basic feature that all applications should now have, LLM applications. Let's see if it works. What is, or how do I, how do I, how do I get the, <sighs> no local LAML matter will set. All right, so there we are. Um, lots to set up. Even though it says it's everything in one go, that is definitely not the situation. Uh, no. 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 Ah, okay. Here it is. Then visit the README. Okay, let's take a look at the README. Common issues. Uh huh. System D service. Okay, this is getting much more complicated than just a simple Docker install. Let's see what happens. Okay. Uh, service environment. All right, so this has been exciting. Uh, and I don't have an easy fix for any of this, so I would say this particular install has been a bust. Uh, this is Docker on, this is anything LLM in a Docker space. Obviously, if you're not a Docker person, uh, expect problems. Thanks for watching, and if this video was helpful to you, uh, hit the subscribe button. Thank you.